since the last wear. Look out for me year after year. Hi, I'm Connie from KidsEarVans.com. We're here with Good Night. Can you introduce yourself? Hi, I'm Liam. I'm John. I'm Sam. Okay. What was the best Christmas present you ever got? Best Christmas present ever. Um, I remember one year I was um, I got a letter from Father Christmas saying that I'd been a good a good boy that year, so I was going to get a special Christmas present. So I went downstairs under the tree, and it wasn't there. And I ran around house screaming, screaming, but it was under my bed, and it was a little tractor, and it had like toy cows and stuff. So I basically was a pet petulant child. That's and then I got my present. That's so not very good. I had rollerblades. No, yeah. I, I had a little toy, the Joker from Batman, and if you put him in water, he changed his face, changed. So. It, it, He'd have like a normal face, <laughs> really put him in water, and then he had kind of the white joker face. I, I realised I didn't have a very good childhood now, <laughs> which is a bit upsetting. What was your favourite game to play at recess? Oh, probably football, but we were, we didn't, well, soccer, you know, <laughs> but we weren't allowed balls, so we used to play with a can. <laughs> yeah, so we, had bottle to top. we used to play bottle top. Why am I in the rubbish one? Yeah, yeah. We had a bottle top and we used to kick that around. Yeah, so. John used to go to my school, but he was kicked out of the school because, you know, the pencils. He sharpened a pencil and stabbed it in another kid's head. And so far, okay. he got kicked out of school. I've, I've calmed down quite a lot since then. Um, I think it comes out in our songs now. So. Brilliant. Healthy. <laughs> If someone made a movie about your life, who would you want to play you, and what would it be called? Amazing. Okay, we, we actually did. We actually ran for this before because oh, we're sad. I can't remember. But I said, I said uh, Leonardo I'd like Frank DiCaprio. Frank Zappa to play in it. Frank Zappa, right? Or yeah. um, Nick Cave. Nice. I, I think cool enough, but I think that would be great. Yeah, that would be good. I think we we all agreed that I was Leonardo DiCaprio, so I got similar eyebrows. <laughs> <Matt's room. laughs> Yeah. No. Who, who said it? And I was Jude Law, but I was a bit disappointed with Jude Law. It's no, nothing. someone said the guy from Full Monster for you. The ginger guy. There's a film called Benny and Jude <laughs> with uh, Johnny Depp, and you look exactly like him from the 90s. And you look like uncannily like the guy that's in it with him. Aiden Quinn or something? Oh, the guy's he sounds handsome. He, he is quite handsome. Isn't Aiden better. Quinn the guy from Full Monster? No, so, sorry. No, that's not the same guy. You better look at him anyway. What would it be called? Oh. <laughs> really holding myself. Hello. Um, I don't know. Come on, we're creative types. We're meant to be uh, three names. I just us. hit stuff with other stuff. You're meant to be creative. I'd like to. I don't know. I like it. I'd like a kind of horror kind of theme to it. So it'd be like Goodnight Learning colon, and then like the return of a word. Jafar. The Jedi. The Jedi, yeah, okay, we'll have the turn of the Jafar. Can we just have Return of the Jedi, a good night, Lenin store? Right? Yeah, we'll go with that, I think. I mean, that's a good one. So. That's terrible. <laughs> <laughs> if you could have dinner with anybody, dead or alive, who would it be? What a very good question. Trevor McDonald. Trevor McDonald. He's got some tails. He probably does. I don't know. Um, Jack, just... Jack Nicholson. That's a great Ooh, one. Yeah. There's obvious ones like John Lennon, Bob Dylan, but Jack Nixon would be great. I'm going to steal that as well. Yeah, I think that, I think that everyone would be happy with Jack Nicholson. Oh, Audrey Tattoo. Just swing cows in the reason. What subject did you like best at school? English and music. I, 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 didn't, I didn't like music at school. I, 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 I quite liked it because we just got to like, in GCSE it was great, in A-level it was terrible. That's yeah. why I, I, I had to leave. I quite, uh, I quite like uh, maths. I was really sad at school, so I liked all those kind of geeky subjects. Yeah. I liked um, history. That's what I liked. When you were 11 and looks like you in front of the mirror, who were you pretending to be? <laughs> um, I, there's a, the, when I was a kid, I tried to cut my hair like someone, um, and it was uh, it's actually an English footballer, John Barnes. <laughs> I'm actually trying to cut my hair. Now, basically, there's, the, there's, a few there's a few reasons I can't look like John Barnes, but he's a skinhead, and he had an Anfield rap, which I can't... Yeah. I don't, I'm not going to sing the Anfield rap. the Anfield rap. I'm not doing the Anfield rap. <laughs> I, can't really remember, really I, can't, I can't remember. I can't remember. But basically, I was a it's footballer really who had one song, and that's who I pretended to be all the time. Jamaica, my name is John Barnes. When I do my thing, the crowd goes bananas. I can't think who I used to like. I used to, like, I don't know, when I was 11, probably like ocean colour scene and stuff, so like 
published Simon Fowler from Ocean Colour Thing and been like uh, the lead singer I reckon. Yeah, uh, yeah. Probably an old band again, I think. What was the best concert you've ever been to? Oh. Oh. <laughs> We're doing go. a lot of that noise, aren't we? Every we question, every question, any noise. Yeah. <laughs> every question, we're really excited. Um, my most favourite one recently was Paul Simon doing Graceland. Oh, that was special, yeah. That, Paul Simon oh. was. But literally, I, I actually wept. I was really drunk with John Jay, but there was a point where we did cry. I think, and there was so much laughter as well, and running round and jumping. We stood in a, we stood in a line. It was we stood in a line of arms around each other while he played Sound of Silence on his own, and I think we got emotional. <laughs> oh, okay. We were drinking a lot, and we were very emotional that day. So uh, it was great. That, for right? me, for me, that was probably one of the one of the best gigs. And like, I had it, it had like my I used to listen to it in the car with my dad from when I was super young. So it reminded me of childhood. Not that that's why I cried, but it was just you know. <laughs> I'd waited years to see it really and then for him to do it. A lot of really repressed cool. memories of his dad yeah. that came out. What about you, Connors? Me. Probably when we were young, the Libertines. Or I saw the Stone Roses this year and that's pretty good. Very, very good. And who's your favourite Spice Girl? Oh, mine, in year, mine used to be Baby. I used to like Jerry in year six, you know, in the, on the first Spice Girls album. That each one of them was in a letter of the word Spice. And I'd cut out, I think it was like the C or whatever, and it had Jerry Halliwell in it, Ginger Spice. And I had it stuck to like the underside of my desk because you'd lift your desk up and all your books were inside. And I had uh, blue tack on. <laughs> <laughs> He's a real big fan. Yeah, yeah, I, I was a big fan. I was a big fan. I was gonna say, I, I, Not of them, you. I just thought I wanted to kiss her. I didn't we, even know why. We had, uh, when we was in school, we had, uh, they tried to create the Spice Boys and there's only 11 boys in my class and I was meant to be one of them and I just rebelled, I was like, I don't want to be a Spice Boy, so I got a bit outcasted from the group, but I, I was super like Baby Spice at the time, the uh, Emma Gunson. Am I being outdone here, like, on the Baby Spice? Yeah, though? two Baby to one Ginger. Very well. Hey, yeah. So, I think I'm not going to go for Baby Spice. Baby Spice. Thank you. Oh, no Thank, you. Thank, Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Why we are still young?